It's early in the morning. Do you know where your mind is right now? Try to gather it in right here. Give it a good place to stay. Think of your skin all around the body and all the pores in the skin. Think of them opening up. Just try to hold that perception in mind. I saw Nature Special one time. They were talking about birds and other animals that help larger animals. And there are two cases of animals, a fish basically, that basically took the parasites off of larger animals. In one case it was a sunfish. It would float down in the water, and these little tiny fish would come up and take whatever parasites there were on the fish off of its skin. And it looked like it was in a trance. It was just hanging there in the water. In another case it was hippos. Again, they went underwater, and these little fish would come up and get all the parasites and bugs, everything out of the cracks in the hippo skin. And again, it looked like the hippos were in a trance, like big blimps floating in the water, perfectly at peace. And apparently what happens is that they have to stifle their aggressive instincts entirely in order to allow this process to happen. And so they go into a trance. So think of your aggressive instincts dissolving away. You just got the pores of your skin open, receptive, not stealing yourself against the world, not fighting the world, just being open for the time being. And see if that perception helps calm things down in the mind, helps center things in the mind. You don't have to go into a trance, but you can get very, very still this way. Allow the mind to feed on the stillness, and then within the context of that open skin, then you can focus in on the breath. And see how the breath changes because you've got this sense of openness all around you. Some people find that when they're focusing on the breath, it's as if they have to fight to get the breath into the body. But you can change that perception too. Have the perception that everything is open all around. And the breath easily comes in, because after all, the breath begins in the body. The air comes in, but the breath begins in the body. And think of that movement of the breath energy in the body, floating out, moving out and out, out, out to the, all the pores of the skin. Everything is open, everything is wide open. The air can come in and go out very easily, with no obstructions. As with so many things in life, it's, you find that when you put up resistance, then you have to live with the resistance. It's like sound coming through. There's the sound of the plane. And if you comment to yourself at the sound of the pain, why does there have to be a plane out here in the middle of nowhere? Then you're resisting it, and then it creates a problem inside. But if you think of the body as being like a big screen, like the screen on a window, the sound of the plane can go right through. Just this breeze goes through the screen. The breeze doesn't catch the screen. And as a result, the breeze doesn't get disturbed. It's because you catch the sound, because you catch things, that you're disturbed by them. So think of everything in the body and the mind opening up. And you're right here in the middle of it. And see what that does is it calms the mind, soothes the mind, and gets you ready for work.